to take him down even one time, but his game plan was hold me, try to take me down. That's why I can't, I can't knock him out. I know it's a little bit early to say now, but is there anything that you wish maybe you could have done a little bit differently? Yes, I think I feel too comfortable in a cage, but I know this looks so bad for the referee. I even think I lose the fight because he controlled, like, I can say he controlled me, but he don't control me. I feel comfortable there, but it's not bad, bad position. And I, for sure, Monday I back to the gym, I will try to throw this with my technique in my arsenal. So was there anything, you know, that surprised you, that he did that, that surprised you in there? No. I know he will be much slowly like me. Like he say, I'm the one in the best, the faster one fighter in middleweight division, and this is what happens. I see everything with Eric throw. Um, and last one for me is, uh, you know, any names in there in mind that you want to get back in there next against? You know, after my shoulder surgery, I just train non-stop in five months. So give me one month break. And I would love to fight to Raya Hall next. All right, thank you. Congratulations on the win. Thank you. Uh, we'll go next to Jay Anderson with Cage Side Press. Your line is open. Thanks very much, and uh, congratulations on the win. Uh, first of all, I mean that's three wins uh, in a row now. That's a uh, you know a good streak that you've got going. Is there anything in terms of your fight camp that you've changed up that's led to that success? You know, I have. Every day, the best coaches in around me, uh, the best sparring partners around me, and now my life is better. I love my my wife, and I feel very comfortable with my life. And this is what I show today. If if I don't have a problem in my private life, I'd be excellent in octagon too. Mm -hmm. People see see only us in the octagon how we fight but they never see what happens in the background behind our private life so that's why we sometimes come to the fight not sure well i'm glad to hear that uh, things are going well in your private life you also mentioned your uh, your shoulder obviously you had soldier shoulder surgery how did it feel tonight tonight i feel amazing my shoulder is perfect thank you to dr gelb by the best doctor, he he fixed my shoulder perfectly, and I don't feel nothing anymore. And finally, you know, you've mentioned the Uriah Hall a number of uh, times now. Obviously, you lost one back in uh, 2017. What is it about that loss in particular that makes you want that fight back so badly? Honest, I go for this fight with broken hands and two infection in my both knee and I almost knock him out. I dropped him three times in one round. In the second round he just touched me one time. He was just lucky and knocked me out. So I can't forget about this. And I want to do this again when I'm hundred percent healthy, you know? All right, well congrats on the win again tonight. Thanks very much. Thank you. Uh, we'll take our last question from James Lynch with the score. Hey, Christoph, um, great win tonight. You, you talked about, uh, you know, having the layoff and then also, uh, you know, being having the surgery. And you said, you know, when we talked pre-fight, you said you were going to see, you know, a more confident, better fighter because you're all healed up. How did you actually feel in there? I mean, you look pretty good, but how did, how, how are you feeling about your performance tonight? You know, I was thinking about how I will feel with not fans, but I feel excellent. I feel like this is just sparring, you know, I don't feel stressed, nervous, nothing. I just go there do my job do my best any nerves at all going to the scorecards just because you never know especially that fight before yeah i was think i lose the fight because every round he he cut with me in the cage so i was thinking the judges judges will be for the eric side and last one for me we talked about uriah hall he was supposed to fight last saturday and uh that didn't end up happening i imagine he's going to want to fight pretty soon here would you be willing to say to take something short just to get that fight or would you rather take some time off you know i was trained like after my surgery like five months straight so give me a little time for recovering my body i don't want to injure myself again you know 
I'm not Terminator, I'm just human and I need to do a little break sometimes. So give me one minute break and let's think in what we do next. Enjoy the victory tonight and thanks for the time.